Ok, donc nous sommes de retour. Uh, we're back, people. So now it's time for Mega Man 10 run by Russell Duckfist. So I hope you will enjoy. Merci à tous donc d'être là. On va passer à la deuxième partie de la soirée, donc un run, uh, un run qui va être fait par Duckfist sur Mega Man 10, Mega Man 10. J'espère que vous allez apprécier la performance. En tout cas, ça va être uh, ça va être assez impressionnant à mon avis. <laughs> TGP. <laughs> yeah. I had a correct I spelling there, but uh, pretty I won't close. Say, I won't say his last name. <laughs> okay, so are you guys ready? Okay, whenever you want, like first. Uh, Can you hear me in the game audio? Okay. Alors oui, est-ce que tout le monde, euh, est-ce que tout le monde ça va par rapport euh, au son? Est-ce que vous êtes euh, Est-ce que vous êtes bien Dites-nous. Dites All is good. Okay, I'm gonna start. Whenever you want, Russell. I'm trying to get the stream up here. Hey, wow, looks looks very nice, man. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Good man. Thanks, man. Now, it's been a while since I've been into this game, so I'm a little rusty. If this ends up being pretty bad, that's why. It doesn't show. <laughs> I didn't say anything. <laughs> Two minor mistakes in the stage. Well, one of them I got hit, so that's like plus one. Yeah. Kind of a bad pump man pattern. Two minutes Another was plus good. two on it. Although that my pump man split is really tight. It's like a 157, which is like almost the best you can get. Yeah, that was a that was a nice stage. Alors je ne vais pas je ne vais pas commenter parce que je veux pas déconcentrer je veux pas déconcentrer le speedrun on peut parler entre les stages elle est mid boss Oh, 
That's pretty good. Yeah. I think I'm like two seconds ahead on this one. Pour le stage de le stage de Solarman qui est vraiment très très difficile. C'est rendu par cœur. Not that much time lost since you have to stop. Yeah, yeah. You gotta wait, anyways. Sorry, Vincent, I can't hear you that much. I turned it down a little bit just in a second. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah. Non, c'est bon, en fait, je peux parler. Il m'a baissé. On se prend un Silverman. Évidemment, c'est. Pretty good. Wow, I have that much time to save on this stage. Yeah, just another second. Damn. Great, man. Il a fait un bon stage quand même là. So you, uh, for RTA timing, you want to end the stage as close to the center of the screen as possible because Mega Man has to run to the center and then jump Oh up. yeah, okay. Okay, okay. But that doesn't account for the in-game timer, so that's one of the few differences between in-game and real time. Yeah. Mais en fait, donc, le code de Gfis, il vient nous dire qu'en en fait, il faut terminer le plus proche well, du centre possible. Well, many differences. Parce que, euh, en fait, Mega Man, il marche euh, jusqu'au centre. Pour arrêter le stage. Il faut finir au centre, absolument. Allez, chill mal en troisième. <coughs> non, Dédaï, c'est du, du café. <rire> c'est du café. about one second behind, thanks to that falling ice block section. So, hey, good pattern. Good pattern. Holy crap, and I still screwed up. Nice. Oh la la. Of course. Allez, c'est bien. Il est sur les traces de de son run. Now, he gave me a really good pattern there. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. Now he can attack uh, two times in a row at most. So after, after, like after he attacks twice in a row, he's guaranteed to not attack. Yeah, okay. But he can only do either twice in a row. So if he doesn't attack twice in a row, you know he's going to attack the next round. So I got lucky that he didn't attack twice in a row right away. And if I predicted that, it's possible to predict it's random. You could just sit there and just weapon cancel match in space. That's probably the fastest way through it. Yeah, okay, got that. Donc là il nous a dit Doc Fist que en fait le boss il a il a un pattern où il attaque deux fois de suite avec euh, son arme. Donc euh, on peut prédire à peu près ce qu'il va faire, c'est un peu comme dans les. comme Galaxy Man hein, sur Mega Man 9. Came up with a new strategy on this part, see if I can remember how to do it. Donc là il nous dit qu'il a, a, a une nouvelle stratégie au point sur ce segment. Et on va voir si ça marche. C'est pas forcément facile celle-là, à speedrunner en tout cas. Ah, 
climbing through these trucks, you pretty much just shoot a chill spike as soon as you hear the, the horn sound. And they designed it so that your reaction time makes it just enough to, to kill the trucks. Ok, donc apparemment les camions ils arrivent juste quand on entend le klaxon. <laughs> so Nitro Man is like one of the easiest stages, but I end up screwing it up everywhere. In my world record run, I get hit by a truck. I think I get hit by two trucks. <laughs> ok, donc ouais, il, il nous dit que c'est un des stages les plus faciles du jeu et que sur son record du monde il s'est fait taper par un, par un, un camion justement. <laughs> donc c'est pas perdu. See, there's a little trick right there. You don't really have to think at all on that screen. You just do a big jump and then shoot every two jumps. And it just works out every time. Okay. okay it's little tricks like that help you play the game. Bad pattern, Mr. Nitro Man. Yeah, he's a pattern. He's a good pattern. I think even though I got hit by a truck, uh, I had a really good Nitro Man pattern last time, so that must have been what. Yeah. Allez, on est à 5 minutes, euh, 5 minutes en retard. C'est encore jouable, hein, carrément. And you get rush jet after you kill four bosses. Okay. And so this route, you pretty much don't need rush jet for those four stages, but it's useful in the remaining stages. Okay. Donc on nous dit qu'on a le rush jet dans le Mega Man 10, on a le rush jet après quatre boss. And there are two paths in the stage. A couple of the stages in this game have multiple paths. The top one is by far faster. Donc sur ce stage, apparemment, il y a deux chemins possibles. Although this is definitely one of my least favorite stages. <laughs> tell you that much. So if you take the top route right there, you get to ride along with the sandstorm. The bottom route has a sandstorm going against you, so you lose quite a bit of time. Okay, donc c'est là qu'il y avait deux chemins. I'm about to come up to one of those big crusher enemies. See this guy? I know he's going to jump over me because when he decides to jump, if you're in the air, he does a, he does a large jump. But if you're standing on the ground when he decides to jump, he does a small jump. So make sure you're in the air like a second or so after they appear. And ah, you can run. Ah, par contre, c'est une très bonne technique qui vient nous apprendre là, c'est que les gros robots qui font hyper des gros dommages. En fait, il faut sauter quand ils décident de sauter. Parce qu'à chaque fois que vous êtes en l'air, quand ils décident de sauter, ils font un gros saut. Alors que si vous êtes au sol, quand ils décident de sauter, vous êtes euh, sûr qu'il va faire un petit saut. Voilà, là on a vu exactement pareil, il était en l'air. Ouais, je demanderai un télo, ouais. Pas pendant qu'il joue, mais euh, je demanderai. Euh... There's a little glitch I have used in fighting Commando Man there. He's the only boss, whenever he jumps, he no longer has like an invulnerability period. Okay. So you can just, if you can time him right, when he jumps, if you just mash in his face, it'll hit him repeatedly. Okay. Only on some jumps though. So it's weird, the task takes huge advantage of this, which is why the task goes Commando Man first, if you're wondering why. Yeah. Commando Man first is not at all viable for RTA. <laughs> okay, get <laughs> right. that. <laughs> not busting your ass trying to figure that one out. Yes. <laughs> This is one of my favorite stages, I think. Um, it's where you really start to switch back and forth between weapons. Naruto. 
A little mistake right there. Looks like I still have my screw around strats down pretty good. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> it's a good nice. Way, man. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> nice man. <laughs> so I lost like a second there, um, climbing uh, climbing those stairs. I didn't kill the spider, so I had to wait for him. Ah, il a pris quand même deux secondes vite. Yeah, TG, he does a really good fight. Il a pris quand même deux secondes cinq de retard. C'est carrément faisable là. It's a little tricky to manipulate blade man right that, like that. Um, if you don't jump at the beginning of the fight the way that I did, or actually right after you shoot the commando, the first commando bomb, you want to jump before he decides before he decides to leave that right wall. Okay, okay, okay. That, that, that makes him go back to the right wall instead of going all the way over to the left, so you can kill him a little bit faster. Okay, donc là il explique un petit peu des la manière de manipuler le, le boss. Hein. À savoir qu'il faut. So, Here, here's the one strat I was talking about that it's hard but saves like half a second. <laughs> you don't have to summon the rush jet right there. So <laughs> you maybe hesitate for half a second and just try to get on get on rush jet. Il m'a dit ça fait longtemps qu'il avait pas repris sérieusement le jeu, mais ça se voit pas trop. Hein. Ah, ouais. ah, man. So the position of these lockers depends on how well you played the stage. So because I lost a little bit of time, they were a little off when I got hit. Okay, donc apparemment les placements qu'on a vu des ennemis qui lâchent des boules, ça dépend du temps que vous avez mis sur tout le stage. C'est quand même incroyable. Précision. Screwed up the screw around strats. Ugh. <laughs> ah man, no quick kill on this guy. Serious time loss there, check that out. Yeah. Hey, I saved the half a second at the first room. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> Boy, he said that there was a big time loss there. He almost saved the half a second with the rush jet. With the no rush jet, just right. Et la 8 secondes, il va falloir. Il va falloir y aller quand même, 8 secondes 1. Ça va être chaud. Hein. This stage has one of my favorite songs in the game. Allez, Nikos. 
Wow, le coup de kill sur le mid boss là, énorme. Wow, on a vraiment ce truc. Oui, là c'était chaud là, le sous-sous là, pixel près. Ooh, I could make these platforms. Oh, I think I just screwed up. Ooh, maybe I made it. Let's see. Oh, I made it! Holy shit. Nice. That's really hard to do. Probably the third time I've ever made that. D'accord, alors il me dit que c'est apparemment la, tout simplement la troisième fois qu'il a réussi à faire le, le quick jump. <rire> Use pizza would be pissed if he saw it. I think I'll make another 20 if I get a good boss. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah! What was that nice? Whoa! Ho, ho, ho. Four seconds. Holy shit. Yeah, so not the only way you can actually make that platform is if you're perfect throughout the rest of the stage. So not only being perfect throughout the rest of the stage saves you time, but you get a bonus second because you don't have to rush quite along those spikes there. Okay. okay. So it's a decent sheet manual as well. Well you think you can attain the platform you could set it directly, it fallait qu'il fasse un run parfait sur le stage. Et donc ça a marché, hein, ce qui nous a fait gagner quand même uh, 3 secondes 8. C'est vraiment énorme. Donc là ça redevient jouable, hein, 4 secondes 3. Il y a moyen. Now there's a little bit of a manipulation that goes on this very first room of the first stage. If you reach the boss door without stopping, um, you can predict which enemy comes out. Because the random number generator, part of its seed is based on the level timer. So I can tell it's going to be a like man starting first if I don't slow down. Okay. Donc en fait, ouais, ils viennent nous dire qu'il y a des mid-boss hein, dans le jeu, hein, vous le savez, hein, on retrouve des robots masters, hein, et en fait, si vous si vous arrêtez jamais de, mar de marcher, et ben c'est Lekman qui arrive en premier. C'est pour ça qu'il sait qu'il va déjà avoir Lekman. I've had it like be weird and not be first sometimes, but it's like 95% of the time he's first there. Lekman normalement. Voilà, c'est Lekman. Lekman. Actually, I was slow. I should have been on the right side of Gemini Man uh, when he dropped. But that's okay. Okay. I was a little safe in those jumps. I just don't want to die. <laughs> that's understandable. of a show-off trick right there. Jumping before you enter that room is risky, but I don't know why I do it. Okay, he says that he takes a little time to jump, but he does it all the time before going to the hall. We have all our little habits. That was a bad ring. This is like the best track in the game, it's so awesome. It's hard to kill that spider. <laughs> Donc, euh, le robot a sauté euh, haut. 
I think I'm a little low on triple blade. That should be fine. Wasn't so great. I used an extra commando bomb on accident. So uh, that happens, man. <laughs> I should be fine against the crab. If the crab gives me a good pattern, I can I can take him out with uh, the amount of commando bombs I have. Yeah, okay. I think I should have four. <clears throat> the crab. Yeah, I could have screwed it up. I'm not totally sure. I might not have enough. So we have I love this track too. It's good to use it. Whoops. <laughs> Gotta be fast now. Okay, that was good. Okay, I think we're still on track. Ooh, I don't know. Kind of screwed that up. Okay, I'm good. Now we have the so-called hardest jump. Made it. Yes. Ouais, ce jump, il est tellement dur. Okay, I didn't do triple it, just in case. Should be able to make this. Let's see. Les stages, ils sont tellement durs dans le jeu, c'est incroyable. Oh! <laughs> Not gonna like that one. <laughs> that happens, man. Yeah, it looked like I made that jump, but this this puts you way back. That's so much. there goes the run. <laughs> it's okay. I, if, I, if I ever break the record, I want to get sub 1950 on the Age Robot Masters. Even though that was sub 20, that was still kind of bad. Ah, tout à fait, Vic. Je dirais moi. I have to wait here. I'm not sure where these things are at. I think I might be a little real low on rush jet. I got three shots against this guy. I don't think I can. You, you need four shots to kill him with a good pattern, so. cost you in this game. <laughs> well, that was one of the worst places you can die at, because I had a refight mini boss. Yeah, and right. it was a very I see, fast. Yeah. Wish I could bring my splits now. Ugh, it looks like shit. <laughs> Don't worry, Duck Fist. <laughs> okay. it's, it's well now that the pressure is off, we're gonna try Yeah try some cool risky. Yeah. <laughs> voilà, maintenant que uh, il sait qu'il va plus uh, Il va plus battre son record. Il va tenter des trucs un petit peu. I, I'll most likely die here, but I'm gonna try. Comment il fait ça, quoi? Ah, y a, y a pas de, y a pas de reset, hein, rigueur. 
Oups. C'est le run pour la France. Allez. Ok, the death was worth it. I don't know if I have enough rush jet here. Ah, c'est, c'est, le, c'est le run de la France là. C'est le run de la France. Il fallait un peu un, un moment sac. Wow! I don't know if you guys saw my weapon energy there, but. Ouais, il y avait plus rien en énergie là. If I get a good boss fight, could be sub 2.30. My best time is like 2.30, 50. <coughs> oh yeah, screw around strats. Always forget those. Nice! Whoa! <laughs> That's a boss fight. to say with a fast boss fight and pro strats on elevator 1. Bah justement, on était là, voilà. Faut juste, euh, là, il n'y a même pas de questions à poser. Hein. Faut que tu regardes le pattern, comment il a fait. Hein. Faut que tu tires avec l'angle. Et... Voilà. Il n'y a pas de questions à se poser. <rire> Alright, see how lucky we get. Push us underneath a minute with time lost. Yeah. <rire> be totally sad, because it would demonstrate how much time you can save on top of the world record. Sur les boss, hein. Can't get those cheat man quick kills. That's tough. Use Pete's is really good at killing cheat man fast. See, I should have got multiple hits there, but just because this game is really finicky and when it <laughs> lets you exploit the glitch like that, sometimes it just doesn't work. Yeah, okay, I see it's Like I hit him with like five wheel cutters, but it only counted one. Mm-hmm. 
Ah, good pattern. I kind of screwed it up. Dommage, un hit près. A little exploit with uh, the Thunder Roll there. The Clouds normally only do one damage, and the Bolt does like four. Ah, that should But if you position an enemy underneath the Bolt, you can hit him point blank with your second Thunder Roll a couple of times, and it'll do max damage. That up a bit. Ouais, bien joué quand même là. Oh là, 7 secondes. Nice! Nice, Doug Fist. Oh, <laughs> That's too bad you lost the life. I swear very loudly there, but That's why did I just save 10 seconds from Wiley 2 to Wiley 4? Oh, oh god, c'est tellement dommage. I didn't die. This is the world record, guys. Oh yeah. No doubt about that. I'd be minus 3 at this point, right? Yeah, that's really too bad. Yeah, just luck. Plus, I had a, I had kind of had a bad capsule pattern on the world record too. Shows you how much the run sucks. I just, I kind of just beat it just to get it back. I didn't put that much effort into beating it again. <laughs> it could be way improved. Oh, look at that! I fucked that up. Oh man, no more tiki manipulation. Look at that shit. Come on, Wiley Five is a trolling. You like that? <laughs> Look at these drills. I don't even know what's happening. Ah, c'est tellement, c'est tellement un run à la française quoi. Le skill en plus quoi. Speed runs cancelled. Everyone go home. Okay, bye. Wait. <laughs> go back. <laughs> Share my humility. I totally do. <laughs> Should be entering the boss door right now. Il a dit que so that's like. Terminé, that's like. Several times. <laughs> I actually have a low life. Oh man. Good pattern, guys. Good pattern. Nice. Damn. Oh, I gotta skip some text here. Yeah. So 37 with a death. Ah, c'est vraiment, uh, c'est vraiment dommage. That's too bad you died. Yeah, that's really too bad. Man. <laughs> that's okay though. Um, where did I die? Oh man, it's Wiley 2. That's no excuse. Wiley 2 last chance. So yeah, lots of room for improvement there. Yeah, but. Yeah. It was really a great run. It was really funky, but <laughs> I liked it a lot. Thanks. I think I showed off some interesting yeah. stuff there. Uh, there. There were some highlights. There were some highlights. Yeah, completely. Yes. Really good Wiley 4. Um, had a, mostly the Wiley 4. It was a good chill man fight. Good, good uh, blade man fight. Yeah, you had a great eight bosses run. Yeah, could have been way better still. Didn't quick kill sheet man. Night bad pattern on nitro man. So there's still <laughs> another like five seconds. Ah, c'est dommage. Je... Ouais, donc là on parle un petit peu des, des, des trucs qui auraient pu être améliorés, comme euh, Shipman qui a, il a pas tué, mais euh, les B-Boss euh, qui auraient pu être améliorés encore. Mais vraiment c'était un beau run. Anyway, that was a really great run, Duckfest. Just for the showcase, it was, uh, it was really nice. Thanks, yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I'd actually be happy if I got that time. Uh, I'm playing in the upcoming. I'm playing Mega Man 10 against Use Pizza. And yes. At the SMW thong two weeks from now. Yep. So he's uh, he's much more in practice than I am. Uh, that will be a tough <laughs> one, yes. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I might pl I'll play. I'll only play through this maybe just once or twice before that thing. I mean, I'm just not really too into Mega Man 10. It's been a while. Yeah, stay uh, relax. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a pretty casual thing at this point. It's just a recollection of muscle memory. Okay. <laughs> that was great.
Bah écoutez, j'espère que vous avez apprécié tout le monde. En tout cas, ce run, c'était euh, vraiment euh, incroyable. Euh, alors, il y a. Est-ce qu'il y a une autre question ou deux uh, I saw a question from Dead okay. Eye. I'm gonna try. Uh, ah, yes. Do you use the music as a, as a way to. Uh, to get through the stages because you you focus on the on the burst and the music a lot. <laughs> I know I do that too but Yeah, well I mean I just really like the music so <laughs> so that's 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 why I shoot. That's why I kinda of, you know play to the music because there's nothing else to do. You stand on an elevator and I mean you're dodging spikes every now and then but there's nothing else okay. to do. Okay. That was just exercise like yes. you're mashing a little bit. So it's just a little picky question. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but uh, I actually do use <clears throat> actually use a musical cue on the very final stage. Okay. Um, to the, the tiki discovered this we call the tiki manipulation. If you enter the boss door on a certain frame, which can be accomplished by jumping, oh, like yeah, on the I, I know what you mean. Yes. You can attempt to manipulate this pattern. Yeah. yeah. But other times, I can I can actually hear the music and tell how good I'm doing in the stage. Like if I haven't, if it's. You know, when I get to a certain point, I expect it to be at a certain part of the music, particularly in Sheet Man. Like that's how I was able to tell in Sheet Man that I would make that, uh, that block. Yeah. Okay. 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 Donc oui, apparemment, là, il se sert de la musique. Euh, alors des fois, quand il y a faut tuer le temps euh, et que c'est automatique, t'as rien à faire. Bon, évidemment, il fait ça pour s'amuser. Mais sinon, euh, généralement, il sait où il est dans le stage. S'il en avance, c'est en retard, euh, rien qu'avec la musique. Donc c'est quand même, euh, ouais, c'est quand même un, un bon élément, quoi. Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, I guess. We're gonna stop from that, and uh, anyway, it was a it was a real great run. I hope everybody enjoyed it. Merci à tous. En tout cas, merci merci tout le monde. Et puis, euh... oui, non mais ce n'est pas. Ça. <laughs> I don't know if you're gonna stream. I just wanted to say thanks to everybody. It's yeah. <laughs> so uh, just don't forget to check out uh, speeddemosarchive.com next weekend and uh, for the. Speedrun Spookathon, I think is what it's called. Right, Following weekend, SMWathon, and of course, Awesome Games Done Quick 2013. Voilà, donc n'oubliez pas évidemment regarder les, euh, les prochains marathons qui vont se faire avec les liens qu'on vous a donnés. En tout cas, euh, ça a fait extrêmement plaisir. It was a, a real pleasure to have you, Duckfest. It's always nice to, to see that uh, the speedrunners are, uh, are willing to give their, uh, some, some of that time to, uh, to speak with friends. <laughs> Anyway, merci à tous et puis euh, on se retrouve très très bientôt. Merci à tous ceux qui ont participé et bonne soirée tout le monde. <rire>